What's up everybody, it's Crypto Rocket bringing you the latest and most important news in the crypto world. Guys, you have to stay informed if you want to win at the crypto game. I make videos every single day bringing you the most important news that you need to know to win in the crypto market. That's why subscribe to the channel if you want to make a lot of money in crypto. The most important news we're gonna talk about today are... Pantera tells SEC its crypto fund has raised nearly $165 million. Here's what analysts are thinking after Bitcoin surged above $12,000. Market wrap Bitcoin cracks $12,000, DeFi crosses $6 billion locked. Bitcoin is now bigger than the Bank of America and the NZ dollar by market cap. Bitcoin investors swap for Ethereum wrapped BTC to yield farm and chill. Ray scales Bitcoin Cash and Litecoin trusts begin trading publicly. We chain implementation in Chinese gas sector enters test phase. But first let's check out what's happening with Bitcoin. Okay. So, in the last video, I showed you this triangle right over here. And I told you that if, if Bitcoin passes this trend line, this top trend line right here, then we will go above 12k. And it did! <laughs> it finally did. So, it was pretty close to this trend line here. It was moving, moving, moving. So, there was a thought that it could have gone down, but no. It got up all, and it got all the way up. So, look at this a beautiful thing here. You know, it went up almost to $12,500, which is amazing. Right now, it's starting to fall a little bit, so it's stabilizing. But, it looks like maybe it's forming a flag if we look at look at the one hour chart let's see that it's not only the reds it's we have a little bit of greens here so maybe it's gonna form a flag a bullish flag and when we get a bullish flag what does it mean we have 64 percent chance for it to go even more up so this is amazing because this happened in one single day so look at this green line it's so beautiful guys this is amazing we can make a lot of money from this and not only from bitcoin we can make a lot of money from all the coins because if bitcoin's growing that means the whole market the whole crypto market is growing and more investors are gonna come in and more coins are gonna be made that can make a lot more money for you use this opportunity to make a lot of money guys but you need to stay informed so subscribe to the channel for the latest news in the crypto world Terra tells SEC its crypto fund has raised nearly six 165 million dollars Institutions and the well-heeled have poured millions of dollars into a Pantera Capital Fund, helping it more than double it in size since its launch in 2018. They got 165 million in only two years. The Pantera Venture Fund 3 has received 164.7 million in private placements for just under 200 investors. So there's actually 200 investors in the Pantera Fund. According to a form D filling with the US Securities and Exchange Commission on Friday, that's nearly 60 million more than at the date of its last filing in, and the well over 93 million double. But the fund had two years from when it's first filled with the US market watchdog. Pantera had originally hoped to raise 175 million for Venture Fund 3 and said in March last year it has crossed the 160 million milestone. Because of these kind of things happening, crypto funds are happening and people are investing in them, that means there's a lot more money on the table and the big dogs are starting to show interest in Bitcoin and this is so good because if the big dogs start investing, then we are going to make a lot of money you have to play smart right now and buy as soon as possible before it's too late because it's gonna be more and more and more until it just stops or maybe it's gonna go even more up we, we don't know right now here's what analysts are thinking after bitcoin surge above twelve thousand dollars after two weeks of consolidation under 12k Bitcoin cleared that technical resistance every Monday morning. According to TradingView, cryptocurrency trades at 
$12,320 at the time of this article writing. With the rally fighting legs on an influx of buying volume and exchange like Coinbase and Bitstamp. Bitcoin's latest leg higher tied it with a move upward in the value of gold. The pressure material almost matched Bitcoin's price performance, with both rally a few percent higher over a matter of hours. So it looks like gold has even matched up with Bitcoin. So it's it's a giant matchup. As people are investing into gold, they're investing into Bitcoin too. And I think it's all about the Warren Buffett move that he did, that he started investing in gold. And he told everybody he's like never going to invest in gold. But if he is now investing in gold, that means one day he will maybe invest in Bitcoin. And if he does, that's gonna skyrocket the whole market. Analysts are optimistic about what comes next for Bitcoin, citing the importance of the $12,000 level, $12, level to Bitcoin re recent price action. Bruce Guyland feeded that there is really not much overhead resistance above $12,000. Next up is 13 and 800 peak of previous high than all time high. So Bruce thinks that in the next coming weeks, it's going to surge to $3,800. And I believe that also. And he thinks it's going to gonna go to an all time high. So he thinks it's going to go way above what it was a few years ago. And if it does, this is going to be so cool, guys. We're going to have so much money. Market wrap. Bitcoin cracks 12.4k. DeFi crosses 6 billion locked. Bitcoin made a major gain Monday while investors have locked over 6 billion in crypto into various DeFi services. Bitcoin trading around 12,332 as of 8 o'clock UTC, gaining 4.1% over the previous 24 hours. Bitcoin 24 hour range. So in the previous 24 hours, it was $11,774. But now it's $12,485, $700 in just one day. This is a lot. This is, this is just a lot, guys. This is amazing. This is so good. This is beautiful. In just one day, it surged up $700 more. This is just insane. Bitcoin slightly above its 10-day and 50-day moving averages, a bullish sign for market technicians. The world's largest cryptocurrency by market capitalization opened the week with higher than normal volume, pushing Bitcoin to a high as 12,485. For some market observers, it was only a matter of time before it happened. We knew this was gonna happen, guys. Everybody knew, but some people didn't trust Bitcoin and they didn't make money. But we are the ones who are going to make all of the money. Bitcoin has been trading in a 11,000 to 12,000 range for two weeks or so. It has been consolidating and threatening to break past 12,000, so this is not too surprising, he added. And this is not a surprise at all, because we knew it's going to happen, because we know what's going to happen, because we watch, we watch the market, we do the research every single day to make things happen, to make money. That's why, that's the only way you can win at this game. So subscribe to the channel to the most important and latest news in the crypto world. Bitcoin is now bigger than Bank of America and NZ dollar by market cap. As Bitcoin reaches a new yearly high of $12,470, its market cap is now greater than the Bank of America and New Zealand's flat currency. As Bitcoin gets more support from its first time investor, its market capitalization has risen past Bank of America market valuation and put it within striking distance of PayPal's. According to Asset Data at the time of writing, Bitcoin current market cap sits just over 226 billion. Having risen 3.2% in the last 24 hours, however, Bank of America market cap has fallen more than 2% today, so that's 224.4 billion. This bullish behavior from Bitcoin and slight drop in Bank of America means that analytics site ranks BTC as the 25th most valuable asset in market capitalization just behind PayPal at 230 billion so it's pretty close it's four billion away to even being higher 
than PayPal. So this is amazing, guys. This is so good. And we only think it's going to go even more, even more than this. Like, like 15k per Bitcoin, 16k per Bitcoin. And if it does, it's going to launch past everything here. Buffett isn't the only billionaire to potentially consider crypto as a new, as a way to hedge his bets in this economy. Paul Toder Johns, the founder of hedge fund Toder Investment Corporation, is also still bullish on Bitcoin since revealing the crypto asset was part of his portfolio in May. Another possible new face to the crypto world is Bostrol Sports founder Dave Portnoy, who recently spoke with Gemini Exchange founders Taylor and Cameron with the assistance of the two brothers. Portnoy purchased $200,000 in Bitcoin and $50,000 in Chainlink, most of his first crypto purchases. So I told you guys, big guys, big guns, the big boys are starting to invest in crypto. Not only Bitcoin, but it looks like Chainlink also. That means we're going to see investors giving a lot of money to really good coins. Let's check out like Chainlink here. What's happening? Okay, so Chainlink dropped a lot here. So this is, this is kind of worrying, worrying some. It's pretty bad, but, but if you see here, we're kind of doing a reversal so it is trying to stabilize back again so that means it's gonna try to stabilize right now and we're, we're gonna see in the upcoming days what's gonna happen right now we can't really predict anything could it because <laughs> we we're not seeing all of the signs right now so we need to wait some time here so don't do anything yet try and see what's gonna happen bitcoin investors swap for ethereum wrapped bitcoin to yield farm and chill the demand for wrapped Bitcoin has surged as Bitcoin investors seek a private method to gain exposure to DeFi and lend farming. The demand for wrapped Bitcoin has been growing tremendously in the last few weeks, with more than 23,000 wrapped Bitcoins that, that are worth 274 million currently in circulation. According to data from Flipside Crypto, a digital asset data provider, more than half of the wrapped Bitcoin was minted in the past month, as the decentralized finance sector has saw record growth. Launched in 2019, Wrapped Bitcoin is an ERC20 token that is pledged to the price of Bitcoin. It allows users to seemingly transfer Bitcoin to the Ethereum network and interact with the smart contracts. To get Wrapped Bitcoin, users must go to an authorized merchant who will hold the user's Bitcoin and exchange it for Wrapped Bitcoin tokens. Merchants can mint and burn wrapped Bitcoin tokens as needed. The growing demand for wrapped Bitcoin shows that Bitcoin users are looking for high yield options to hold Bitcoin. According to a recent report by Genesis, a, a digital currency prime broker, institutional clients are also showing similar interests. Wrapped Bitcoin is by far the most popular Bitcoin backed token used on the Ethereum network, but it is also a, cent a centralized option that requires users to go through a know your customer procedure and to use a third party custodian service. For some potential users, th this raises privacy and censorship concern. Grayscale Bitcoin Cash and Litecoin Trust begin trading publicly. Grayscale Investments, Bitcoin Cash Trust, and Litecoin Trust tri crypto products are set to begin trading publicly on over-the-counter markets after receiving DTC eligibility Monday. The twin funds provide institutional and now retail investor exposure to their namesake cryptocurrencies, Bitcoin Cash and Litecoin. Grayscale has fashioned its growing family of crypto trust as a gateway for investors who lack the technical know-how or risk tolerance to hold coins themselves. Prior to the announcement, Grayscale reported a credit investor already held 6 million shares and 2.5 million Litecoin shares. Those shares can now trade publicly as long as the institutional buyer one-year hold period has been met. Shares in our 10 prior places are only available to institutional and accredited investors. So it's great to continue to work with regulators so more investors can access the asset class. WeChain implementation in Chinese gas sector enters test phase. The implementation of WeChain in the Chinese gas sector has entered into the test phase. Zoshin station is the first to test the solution. 
WeChat has partnered with the Chinese company and is in charge of providing and developing the blockchain infrastructure of the project. At the time of publication, WeChain price is 0.0206 with a gain of 5.12% 5, 5 over the last 24 hours and thus seems to be benefiting from the latest news by Chinese energy sector. Moreover, in the last 3 days, WeChain is showing a gain of almost 12%. So if we look at WeChain right now, we can see it actually is going up. So it went up all the way to 0 0.02, which is amazing. But right now it's going a little bit down, but more and more news are going to come out. More and more companies are going to start using WeChain and this coin, this cryptocurrency right here will skyrocket. Guys, hopefully you learned something in this video that can help you make a lot of money in the cryptocurrency world. Thank you so much for watching. I would appreciate it if you could subscribe to the channel and like this video. It helps me a lot to get recognized in this world. Thank you so much for watching. See you guys in the next one. Bye.